if you love The Little Mermaid and musicals, tonight is your night. The Disney classic is going prime time with a live musical production. To make you part of that world, we've got the coolest things you need to know about the original movie, and it's on the hot list. Anytime you put a little Disney into your life, it just gets better. John Stamos, Queen Latifah, and Shaggy are just some of the megastars coming together tonight for ABC's The Little Mermaid Live. Part animated film, part live spectacle. 100% Disney magic. To get you prepped, let's first look at how successful the original movie was. Have you ever seen anything so wonderful? The Little Mermaid was released back in 1989, and it made a splash with critics. Certified fresh on Rotten Tomatoes with a solid 93% score. Oh my gosh. And while The Little Mermaid may have been underwater, the finances weren't. It grossed over $184 million worldwide. Yes. Something else that was a hit, the soundtrack, which is certified six times platinum by the Recording Industry Association of America. Part of your but the success of the soundtrack didn't end there. It also got tons of awards. The movie earned two Oscars, one for Best Music, Original Score, and another for Best Original Song for Under the Sea. The iconic tune also earned a Grammy for Best Song Written Specifically for a Motion Picture or for Television. Under the sea. And another song that stood out, Kiss the Girl, which received both an Oscar and a Grammy nomination. But The Little Mermaid didn't just inspire one movie. You're my beautiful melody. The original got a sequel in the year 2000 called The Little Mermaid 2, Return to the Sea, following Ariel's daughter, Melody. This is me. Then in 2008, Disney released a prequel titled The Little Mermaid, Ariel's Beginning, following Ariel's adventures before the events of the original movie. There's more to this place than meets the eye. And there's a live action version currently in the works with actress Halle Bailey, set to play Ariel and Melissa McCarthy reportedly playing Ursula. My dear sweet child. And finally, The Little Mermaid has also been brought to life off screen. A Broadway musical adaptation launched in 2008 and earned a Tony nomination for Best Original Score written for the theaters. And while mermaids are half woman, half fish, The Little Mermaid is even more versatile, spawning video games, tons of books, and a Disney World attraction. I just love how they just bring all these things to life. Bringing The Little Mermaid to life and making her a part of your world on the hot list.